Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to get your product's ID in WooCommerce WordPress. First of all guys, I will need you to go to your WordPress dashboard and then open it by going to wordpress.com slash wp-admin and log into the dashboard. After that guys, I will need you to go to your plugins. So here we go, then click on add new. Then simply go to here to search for plugin. So here we go and click on WooCommerce. Click enter. Wait a little bit. So here it goes. Now in the WooCommerce section, all you need to do is click on install now. As you can see, it doesn't appear for me because I already have it. Just click on install now and then click on activate. After that, all you need to do is click on install plugins, go to active and make sure that it is activated. If not, go to inactive and you will find it over there. Now, as you can see, it is activated for me. So I'm, I'm going to do is pretty much this, which is reload the page. So I will have these over here, which are like the menu of WooCommerce. Now, to get our products ID, all I'm going to do is actually create a new product so I can have this ID. So here I put the name. So let's put some kind of a name. Here, description. Here, put the image, gallery, tags, category, price, and so on. After you finish with that, you can just publish it. Now let's go to own products. So I will show you my own products and their ID. So as you can see, when you first open the page, you will not notice the ID thing. So how you can actually know it? Because here there's date, tags, categories, price, stock, uh, SKU, and here the name. So to be able to know which products ID you have, you just, wa you just want to, to hover over like the, the product itself. For example, let's me hover over Pringles. So here we go. And here it is the ID. So it's 56. Here is the ID of Pringles 2. And this one is for this product that we have just created. So guys, that's how you can get the ID of your product. So thank you guys for watching and see you guys in the next tutorial.